My bedroom had a book closet, and it was full, floor to ceiling. That must have been certainly eight or nine or 10 years old. I wanted to show that women have always been working and been productive members of a society. So it was a voyage of discovery for me, though. This is a pamphlet called Fanaticism. Its source and influence illustrated by the simple narrative of Isabella in the case of Matthias, and it's published in 1835 in New York. Well, I knew that Isabella was the slave name of Sojourner Truth. So this is a very important court case, and Sojourner Truth testified, and this is her narrative in the court case. So that's, that's a really special little piece of history. It's quite rare. It's that magic revelatory moment for students to handle and see things that have survived. This is a letter of Emma Goldman's. This is 1909, and it goes for well, about 200 letters, plus Berkman letters. This will all be available for people to use at last for research for students. It's, it's, it's a terrific thing to have happen that they're going out into the world. <laughs>